We are up and moving. We also have a hay wagon. It's nighttime. I love nighttime lessons in the in the summer. Missing the baby. No baby here. It's past her bedtime. <laughs> her baby. Just let you're aware, Gabby's eating plain sugar. Yeah, she's eating sugar cubes from the horse treat. Excellent. Mm -hmm. We need to bring those to the to the horse shows. You ready to start trotting? Wait, okay. Fiona. She has to eat her sugar cubes. Yeah. Man, the smell of that is overpowering, eh? The hay? Yeah, it's like nice, it. but ooh, it's strong. Yeah. It's one of my favorite smells. So I noticed that then definitely is like way calmer, way smoother, like just goes around like a beautiful little boy with the pelum. Yeah. But she doesn't, she's not even using the pelum probably. No, she doesn't use it. It's no, just, but just having it in his mouth. Oh, I know, I think he does too, but so many people have a preconceived yeah. idea about it being a bad bit. So they think like, you know, it's not good for him. But I notice, like, I feel like he likes it too. Especially because she's using the other rain most of the time. Yeah. And there's Lazy Girl eating her sugar, drinking her coffee. Mm -hmm. So Fiona like thinks it's crazy that I don't know Sam's coffee, how Sam takes his coffee. But she doesn't even know her husband's blood tape. The right. That was where he was lame, yes. So I don't know if I said, but the farrier did like a couple of different new things. He put like a little, oh there's Finn coming around the thing. They, he put a little lift in one of his feet, a little tiny wedge or something, to, because he, the... It feels weird. I'm gonna remember it for the show though. <laughs> that helps. I place better in the EQ, the guy's shoulder thing on. I love that they call it EQ and not X. Go ahead, I'm glad. I call it EQ too. <laughs> you only call it X in the States. Canadians call it EQ, Fiona. All the Canadians up here that I know call it X. All the ones I know call it EQ. <laughs> it's only me and Gabby. Be your wall in your video, <laughs> it's man. only me and Gabby and Kaylee that call it that. <laughs> I don't even know if Kaylee... It's called EQ, not EQ. I was trying to fight Fiona. <laughs> but to be fair, it's spelled EQ. I know. Yeah, ek. Equitation. Equitation. That's what it's from. Equitation. Equitation is about your EQ, though. Oh, God. Ek just sounds so we dumb. We could do this all night. I know, and I would never, ever not win. <laughs> Only because you would outlast me. I know, I would totally outlast you. Yeah. Counterbend him a hair. Thank you, and outside leg. So he's been looking sound? He's looking lovely right now. How did this happen? How did he like, he's like one of those horses that just wants to keep you guessing. He's like, aha, we're not showing, aha, we're not showing. Change rain. Aha, we're showing. Bring your legs back, Sophie. That was good for my leg. That was stunning. That was pretty good. He's probably ready to get back at it. Look Keep at him. His nose balance. You're not worried about his ears. You're worried about his nose. Well, that's good. You want his nose directly in front of his neck. If it's off to one side, that means he's cockeyed. <laughs> Sophie working on her sit trot. Yeah. Good girl. It Try needs to, to be better. Stirrups. It's easier without stirrups. Just do little bursts of it. I agree. Chin, fix your stack of plates in your book. Use your peripheral vision. I can't do that. <laughs> can't do you that can. Either. There's no such thing as can't. I think you overestimate my eyesight. I can't see my hands right now. Although I took her to the eye doctor recently, and she has almost 20/20 vision. Exactly. I, but I can't see my hands. She's good. I don't like this bit on him. You don't like it? No, I think he plays with it way too much. Like way more than normal. Okay, you tell her that. She feels like he listens to her a lot better with it's it. it's the strongest bit you've used. His neck is crooked. Focus on his nose. I have a beautiful happy mouth. 
soft pellet at home. But oh, I have a happy mouth somewhere. Not a soft one, though. And I cannot well, find not, it anyway. They're, they're soft bits. They're not soft rubber, though. Mm -hmm. but you can find happy mouths that are soft rubber, I think. Close nose in a hair. Shorten your left ring so they're equal. That's better. That's better. We really need to really focus on keeping his nose straight to help his neck out. He needs to recondition and rebuild those muscles in the proper spots. He's building them in the wrong spots and it's causing him to have a jam in his neck. So we really, 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 really need to focus on that nose. But just so you guys know, he doesn't actually have a jam in his neck. No. We had a chiropractor visit and acupuncture. We just have to remind Gabby in a way that she will think about it. Yeah, we have to like it's make it sound course. really bad so that she's like, oh, I will never make you hurt. Because she does love him. Yeah, I know she does. <laughs> there you go. Scoot your bum forward. Right here in the corner. Just sponge your left ring. Sponge it. Sponge. There. He's straight. Sponge it. Sponge it. Sponge it. That's all you need to do. Yeah. You don't need to pull or bump. Is it going around the corner so that it's the most? More. Yeah. yeah. He's kept, keep it, she's keeping it more straight on him on the straight. Mm hmm Let's change rain. Are you guys enjoying the nice big way hay, hay wagon? Wagon hay? Hagen way. <laughs> hey, whatever it's called. Look up. Right yeah. leg. Now they know why I say EQ instead of ACK. No. Leg. Leg. There you go. How does the horse like suddenly be not laying? Like that's just so bizarre. Left to left. It's probably hard when you come around a wagon and you don't know the other person's there. Her sister did call it. Oh. Check your rising. Those yeah, are not. Ask Gabby. Gabby's run into many riders. <laughs> Brandon included. So Look how straight that is! Oh my god! Now just left hand sponge on the corners. So it's always the left hand that's gonna sponge, no matter what direction you're going. Every corner, left hand sponge. And we have a straight nose. Left hand? Yes! Oh left hand? Left sponge, 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 yes, 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 yes. You have to teach her again how to do that thing where she was bending each way so yes. that she can... We that's... can't do it in here right now. Mm. It's not going to work. Because mm. if she cuts her corner too much, she's, yeah. And I can't see her properly. It is freaking hot now. Whew. Welcome to the rest of the club, Laura. Sweating Did you just now. finally catch up to us? Yeah, but I mean, at least it's cooler <laughs> than it was today. So... On those left hand sponges, if he starts to counter bend too much, just add a right sponge. You're not bumping, you're not pulling, you're just adding that little, no, I just need you to stay straight. Oh, kind of like a hole. Yeah. I also think that he really chews on this bit, like more than normal. <laughs> She's like, oh, you don't too bad for you. I know it's the strongest bit so you get more control. Push your hand forward. More leg. Sponge the left, sponge the left, sponge the left. How do you feel in that bit? I definitely want Gabby to ride in a bit that that he listens better to her because a lot I of her agree. problems are that he doesn't listen and then I think it would actually that would actually be a good bit for him. What is that one? That's the one you borrowed from Brandon. The level two miler with the hooks. It's got the leverage. Now he would be able to use it with a chain still, which I think would give him to change over nicely with less leverage than the Pelham. You just put a curb chain on it just like the Pelham has, just to hold it steadier, and it gives him that same transition. How are you? Really good. How are you feeling? Does he have to have... It is. <laughs> Trying you know, a different... Multi <laughs> Push your hand forward. Good. 
we'll get that out. See how light he is in your hand? Yeah. Yeah. I'm more focused on me losing my stirrup. Oh, we'll keep that. Find the left. Poof, Gabby's gone. Poof, Gabby appears. Shorten the left an inch. Yep. Oh, there's more lights. That's the third time we've passed lights at this road. Like ambulance or police car. Let the lights on. There's always ambulances on this road. He just holds himself there nicely, doesn't he? I know, we need this for the show in two days. <laughs> mm, there we go. You can borrow mine. It's not a, a French link center, but it's a big enough bit that it'll fit him. All right, soft downward transition, not too heavy on the front feet. And then walk. We'll give you a walk, change direction, we'll let your sister take a little canner and stretch her horse out. So why does she have to have a curb if he does fine with it though? Uh, it just makes it work a little nicer and it doesn't keep it from splaying out. Good. Good. Yeah, I have an inhaler in my purse now. Yeah, I don't get mad. fit in the Pelham he really has a hissy fit yeah so we changed bits we swapped them just to see what is just to see because all horses like something different all right let's see the canner and if Finn is liking the miler that Brandon okay. brought Finn is loving the miler yeah no you don't have to loosen it your your range should be one length just hold them don't drop them that's the key <laughs> Let's see a nice transition here. Wake him up a little bit. Prepare him. Oh, well, that's what I do. They're like, walk. I don't know. The whole and you're, time I that's right. Step him up. Leg yield him in a little bit. Get him ready. And then when you're ready, you can just step up into it. Give away. You have to give away your rein right now because you have a stronger bit that he's learning. You got to give him that extra two inches to get up into that canner, okay? Once you're there, then you can put them together better. Don't do that. Don't do that. Oh, no, she rode him on Monday before the farrier did his feet, too. So we did have some exercise. He, she rode him only for a few minutes. Well, like 10 minutes or whatever. I was going to say, he had 10 or 15 minutes of riding. He yeah. at least had some exercise. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He also ran around Oh yeah, he, he's been not just standing doing nothing. Good boy! Lots of love for that transition! Scratch him! Yeah. Keep your reins, yeah! Totally not my foot hitting the wall. No. That big loud bang. Yeah, I saw, I heard it. Good, soften the elbow. So it's essential that you really have a giving arm. Stack your plates, put your bowling ball on top. And then 
use the elbow, girl. Thank you. Drop your hand a little lower towards his neck. Yes, there shouldn't be so much air between your hands and his mane. And use the elbow, even in light seat. More, exaggerate it. Ooh, I pulled back a little bit. Uh-huh, <laughs> exaggerate. See how I counted that? Excellent. You need to establish your canter first. You also need to think when you turn the corner, outside aids, girl. Ride straighter. She's back into her hunter day or her jumper days. I pulled. I pulled. He also didn't think he had to actually jump. So you have to think, push that horse around the corner. I did what I did. The corner was lovely. Then you kind of held him back. Push him around the corner. Now push your hands forward. One, two, three. Good. He does not want to jump that. No, he's avoiding it. Because it's puny. Push him around the corner, look. Outside aid, inside aid. Nicely changes, Chino. Is that what he was doing to get out of it? No, she was leg yielding him and he was doing lead changes with her leg. One more time, look up at me. Ride it straight, ride it with precision. Railroad track. That was not precision. <laughs> so she's gonna ride him tomorrow. Okay. Precision, railroad tracks, look up, think straight to me. Leg yield outside, yes, push him forward. Lovely, let him walk. Bye. Don't you know that you're beautiful?